I'm meteorologist Chris Holcomb from the 11 Alive Storm Trackers. We continue to watch storms coming in from Alabama and our atmospheric conditions would be conducive for the potential for some rotating storms to move through. Now, this map that we're showing you, the tornado environment, this isn't exactly where tornadoes are going to occur. This is just where we see the potential that any storms that occur could have some rotation with them. It's called our tornado environment. That's going to be with us late this evening through the early overnight hours around midnight and after. And then as everything moves over to the east, you can see the uh, tornado environment weakens somewhat and it won't be as likely that we would see tornadoes in the middle of the nighttime hours and toward tomorrow morning as this entire system sweeps on over to the east. So we've had numerous rounds of showers and storms that have moved through some of those with damage over in West Georgia, and there's still the potential for some of those to redevelop. Now we're hoping with our atmosphere being worked over from the storms that came in earlier. We hope we continue to see a trend that these storms will weaken, but I want everyone to be prepared. There is the possibility for still some strong storms late tonight and during the overnight hours. Here's how it looks at 10 o'clock. You can see some of those bands of pockets of heavy rain in any of those. We could see some rotation developing out of that two in the morning. Still some of those heavier showers over to the west. Uh, it becomes a little more isolated in coverage uh, through the overnight hours and in the morning. This is at four o'clock where the heavier rain and storms will be over to the east of us and then everything starts to move on out. So for Friday morning, most everything is going to be pushing on off to the east and we'll see some improving weather later in the day on Friday. This is during the evening Friday. The potential for a few thunderstorms mainly on the south side we think on Friday. Saturday, mostly cloudy skies with just a few scattered showers around. We'll have some peaks of sunshine here and there later in the afternoon, but then late on Saturday, watching another storm system come through and into Sunday, that'll give us the chance for some showers around and then things calming down for a while this week and then more rain coming in later on in the week as well with another surge of cooler air by the end of the week too. 76 degrees for a high temperature on Friday with those uh, rain chances on the south side, then back to a 50% chance for showers Saturday. The potential for some showers, a few storms possible Sunday with highs near 81. Monday looks like the best day with the 10 on the wasometer, partly cloudy skies, a little cooler with highs near 67. And then a low rain chance Tuesday coming up to about a 30 to 40% chance on Wednesday and Thursday, 74 for a high Wednesday, and then around 60 degrees on Thursday with cooler air coming in for the end of the week.